The day I got sworn in as mayor, I was sitting on the stage, I looked out, I saw about 8,000 people there. I was so excited. Uh, I, had, I had a Conti forum because I'm the first Boston College grad ever, uh, undergrad to be mayor of Boston. And what was even more special, I was a wood school graduate. So it wasn't even the day school that got it done, it was the night school that got it done. And I was proud of that fact as well. And I thought to myself, you know, my road to the city hall was not a straight line, it was a crooked line. And part of that crooked line was the Woods College that helped me go straight. And I thought that that would have a, a big impact on, on me becoming mayor of the city of Boston. Uh, being at Conti Farm that day was, uh, for me, very a very proud moment. Um, it was just amazing looking out, uh, seeing the maroon and gold colors in the backdrop, knowing that I walked by Conti Forum many nights going to school, never expecting that someday I'd be going there as getting inaugurated as mayor of the city of Boston. There was many nights where I drove to BC, I parked on Beacon Street, and class would start at 6.30, so I'd get there literally, get a parking spot, and I'd be sitting there eating a sandwich or something, thinking about, do I go in, do I go in? And I'd had this conversation many times, saying, you know, I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna leave. And it wasn't that I didn't want to get a degree, it was that everything else in my life was going on. I was working as a state representative, I wanted to be at a community meeting, I wanted to do this, I wanted to do that. And, and you know, in, in my brain, sometimes the school wasn't the top priority. And, realizing being in school older that your priority sometimes isn't your education. Your priority might be your family, your priority might be your job, or your priority might be something else. But understanding the importance of, of, of getting that degree and finishing the, that, that, that opportunity or, or that work uh, is, is, will, will add to everything else that you have in your life. And the Wood School is, is amazing. Um, place to be, amazing place to learn. The professors are the same that teaches the day school. You're often in class with kids from the, from the day program and you realize you have an advantage over all these people because you have real life experiences and you will learn things and you will meet people that will be lifelong friends. Uh, I was in a class, a statistics class, with a woman who was 72 years old and the two of us were in the back and we're both like, what are we doing here? And you know, we, we would talk about our homework, we would talk about how we're gonna move forward. And it's amazing and I thought to myself, you know, this woman promised her husband who passed away that she was gonna get a degree. So every reason they're there is different, but they're all there for the same reason, to get their degree and move their life forward. My, my message to people who, who, are, who are at the Wood School, stick to it. Um, that last class when I walked out of Boston College, I was walking to my car from Kearney. Uh, I called my mother and told her I graduated. Uh, I think back to, you know, my mother and father leaving Ireland and, and coming here to the country and, you know, they have a son that, you know, went on to become mayor of Boston. But I think one of the proudest things is the fact that their son graduated Boston College.